This video will guide you through how to claim remote working release on your income tax return. Once you have signed into my account, select the Review Your Tax 2017-2020 link on the PAYE Services card. This is the Review Your Tax screen. Two options will be presented here, the Statement of Liability and the Employment Details Summary. Click Request on the Statement of Liability. This will bring up your preliminary end of year statement to show whether you have overpaid, underpaid or paid the right amount of tax. Now, click on Complete your income tax return. To claim your tax credits or reliefs, including remote working relief, you must complete your 2020 income tax return. Follow the steps to complete your personal details, PAYE income and non-PAYE income sections to get to the tax credits and relief section. This is the tax credits and relief screen. You can make a claim for heat, electricity and broadband expenses by selecting remote working relief category from the Your Job heading. You will be asked to confirm whether you receive a daily tax free amount of up to 320 per day from your employer because you work from home. If you answer yes, you must enter the total amount received in 2020 in the relevant field. You must also enter the total amount paid by you in respect of light, heat and broadband. Finally, you should enter the total amount of days work from home. The calculation will be automatically processed when the relevant sections have been completed by clicking Add. When you select Add, you will be asked to confirm your tax credits and reliefs that you have claimed, including remote working relief. You should select Confirm All and Next to proceed. This is the declaration screen. On this screen, you can review the information from the previous sections of the income tax return. If you need to amend anything, you can do so by selecting the back button. Otherwise, if you are satisfied that the information on this screen is correct, tick the box to confirm the declaration on the bottom right of the screen and select Next. You may also print a copy of the screen for your records by selecting the Print button. Finally, you are brought to the Sign and Submit screen. Enter your My Account password in the space provided and select Sign and Submit. If your submission is successful, an acknowledgement screen will display, advising you when your statement of liability will be made available to you and where it will be located in my account. Select OK to complete the process.